Hello, it's Mr. Murphy again, and we're back with Murphy's Math Challenge, The Return. Thank you to the 100 plus students who responded to the last challenge. We're really, really impressed with all your work. So let's get stuck into this one. It's called the chord challenge. OK, so a chord is a straight line that you can draw from one side of the circle to another. OK, and it chops it into regions. So with one chord, the maximum we can chop this circle into is two regions. OK. So if I increase my number of chords to two, I could draw them like this. One there and one there and chop that circle into one, two, three regions. So two chords and three regions. OK, but I think I can do better than that with two chords. I could actually draw a chord here and here and chop my circle into one two three four regions so two chords could make four regions and i'm very confident that that is the maximum number of regions that i could get with two chords so you will need a compass if you don't have a compass anything circular i've got an old candle here you could draw around like so, is to work out the maximum number of regions you can get with three chords, four chords, and five chords. And if you can work out the maximum for that, if you can see a pattern, and if you can use your pattern to then make a prediction about uh, how many regions there will be with 10 chords. Post all your answers back onto show my homework. The best of luck. Thank you very much. Mr. Murphy signing out.